Right now, we're just hours away from a late night launch from the Space Coast. SpaceX is preparing to send up a communications satellite on board its Falcon 9 rocket, and it will light up the night sky. New 6's Clay Lapar joins us live from Jetty Park in Cape Canaveral. Clay, this has been a busy summer for late night launches. People love it out there. Quite the busy one indeed, Eric. Tonight's scheduled for 1128 with weather being 60% favorable, making it the latest in a handful of those overnight early morning liftoffs. SpaceX tweeted out a picture not too long ago showing the Falcon 9 vertical on pad 40 here on the Space Coast. Tonight's launch was initially scheduled for last night, but was moved now with more time to complete those pre-flight checkouts. If everything goes according to plan, this would be the 16th launch from Florida this year, with many of them that summer happening at night and in those early morning hours. Similar to other SpaceX flights, that second stage rocket booster will plan on landing on a drone ship out in the Atlantic Ocean after second stage separation. And plenty of people already setting up to watch tonight's launch here at Jetty Park, including this man from Alabama, a first time launch viewer at the age of 71. There's a lot to learn from the space program and, uh, and I know it's expensive, know it takes a lot of money to do it, but you know, it takes a lot of money to do a lot of things nowadays, so I think it's a good thing to do. Let's find out. Let's explore what we have it before. We and again, that launch scheduled for 1128 tonight with a four hour launch window. Live along the Space Coast, Clay Lepard, News 6. Clay, you'll get a front row seat if it happens. Thank you. We'll talk to you later.